Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. And if you are new, welcome. My name is Liz and today I'm going to share with you my Victoria's Secret and Pink Fine Fragrance Mist Collection. This is in no way near the size as my Bath & Body Works collection, but I think I have a decent amount and I can't wait to share. Over here on my top row, I have Bare Vanilla, I have Bare Vanilla La Creme, Velvet Petals La Creme, and Love Spell La Creme. These are amazing. I can't wait to start using these again. I want to say that come like fall time, I'll probably pull those out. I have two from the Untamed collection. So I have Bare Vanilla Untamed and Pure Seduction Untamed. I have two from like their aromatherapy line. So I have Coconut Milk and Rose and Almond Blossom. Then these here came out, I want to say during the summer. This is Liquid Coconut Nectar Wave. To me, this has that same vibe as like Boardwalk Taffy and Cotton Candy Clouds. It's just a little more of an aqu aquatic take on it. I have Floating Neroli and Falling Waters. Next, we have Neon Lily. This one to me is a really nice kind of feminine lily slash honeysuckle scent. I really do like this one. I need to get more use out of it. I have Electric Poppy. Then I have the Radiant Collection, so I have Bare Vanilla Radiant, Velvet Petals Radiant, Pure Seduction Radiant, and Love Spill Radiant. Over here, I have Tropic Splash, really great in the summer, and then Bare Vanilla Noir. In this last row, I have my Bare Vanilla Crystal, my Pure Seduction Crystal, Velvet Petals Crystal, and Love Spill Crystal. And then these two here, I was actually influenced by It's Mindy. I have the Oppressed Snow and the Cheers again. Aqua Kiss, one of my all-time favorite fresh, clean aquatic scents, and Velvet Petals, which is a really great creamy almond. Those are all my Victoria's Secret fine fragrance mess, so we're going to move on to my pink. My top row, I have my holiday scents. I have Merry Mocha, Warm and Cozy Sugared, Vanilla Snow, and Honey Mist. Then I have the fall collection. I have Basic Vanilla, really, really good. Love this one. Extra Apple and PSL, which smells a lot like the marshmallow, pumpkin marshmallow from Bath & Body Works. Sense of Sorbet reminds me a lot of Boardwalk Taffy and Cotton Candy Clouds as well. I honestly prefer Nectar Wave over Sunset Sorbet, so I may be getting rid of this one. These two are actually based on perfume. So this is the Tease Creme Cloud. Love this one. And the Tease Candy Noir. I actually do really like this one as well. I like pairing this with Into the Night. I have Sweet Orchid, Pink Lemonade, which is great for the summer. And then all of these are also summer as. So this is Coconut Coast, Calm Water, Paradise Bloom literally smells like the beach, Bronze Coconut, and Warm and Cozy. And these are my backups. So I have one basic vanilla and two Nectar Waves. I don't think I need two Nectar Waves. So I may declutter one or two. We will see. So these are the ones that I ended up decluttering. We have Sweet Orchid, Coconut Coast, Bronze Coconut, Warm and Cozy, and Sunset Sorbet. Nothing wrong with these scents. They just weren't ones that really intrigued me or I was drawn to. This is my first cube. Over here, I have my full collection. So I have the full collection of the Crystal, the full collection of Radiant, and the full collection of that spring scent that came out. And then I also have my two teas body mist there. And here's the rest of the mist. So my goal is to have everything contained in these two cubes and not have any overflow. So with that being said, I need to use up some products and give them some love so that I can continue to purchase more items and review them for you all. So that's it for now. Thank you so much for watching. I personally love watching collection videos. So I hope you enjoyed watching my collection, my declutter and storage. And as always, take care, stay blessed, and I will see you later. Bye friends.